Remember in our last 24 hours, we were in Edinburgh and Mo was like, we've just made our way to another city. We're doing a 24 hours in Glasgow, all right now. It's morning time, first things first, it's breakfast. Now we're here at <laughs> Off The Rails. Now it's called Off The Rails because, you know, <laughs> look, don't worry about it. Let's go get some breakfast. got some chai latte, some croissants, and I got myself a naughty vegan breakfast in, is it sea batter, bro? It's it's sea batter. It is sea batter. Yeah, I said it right. Yeah. Perfect day to start the way, man. Fresh, light, and naughty. <laughs> On to the next spot. All right, everyone, here we are at the Hunterian Art Gallery. Now, Vi, what can you tell me about this place? All right, so it's firstly located in the University of Glasgow. It's open between 10 to 5 from Tuesday to Sunday. For the Macintosh experience, the everything else is free, so it's free entry. And the main exhibition that they show here is the Mary Queen of Scott exhibition. Now, based on a quick Wikipedia search, the basics that we know is what? That she died very young at 44 years of age. She had a reign of about 25 years until her forced abdication, and that's pretty much it. There was a, a couple of sad realities at that, and a few movie interpretations. There's, there's been so many interpretations, we kind of lose idea of what she was actually like. So hopefully we can find out more when we're inside. We are at the Riverside Museum. Now, every blog spot, website, recommendation that I saw when I was looking up Glasgow mentioned this place. So it's got to be something spectacular, yeah? So look, let's check it out and see what I got. today about the museum guys let me get my, oh my face real museums. close guess what we're gonna do after this we're gonna go to it. another museum oh my days, could you man. believe it we're actually not we're gonna have lunch but no this place is amazing no, so they have a showcase like of all things locomotive just vehicles steam trains you can even get on parts of them and see what it's like you know it shows you the progression over time <laughs> dude it is well worth it and it's free let's go man on to the next spot All right, people, so while you're out exploring the city and taking the time out to spend the day in your 24 hours in Glasgow, you end up getting hungry. And luckily for us, we found a mad spot called Bread Meets Bread. What I love about this place here, it's not just like an American diner. They do Canadian food like Puchin. Okay, so Puchin is basically like French fries coated in like, well, if you're able to eat meat, you'd coat it in like, um, like pulled beef or like chicken like Which drizzled with gravy have, yeah. sauce it's just amazing right also they have like six different plant-based options so if you're vegetarian or vegan they cover that basically. you got it also yeah. i checked with one of the waiters all the chicken is halal so we got you covered covered so explain the burger you have to explain the madness that so we have in it's front called of us. A, ch a chicken loofah burger yeah. two donuts caramelized Glazed ring donuts. Yeah, and this is Shaq's kind of food. <laughs> you know what? Enough about that. Let's eat, bro. Oh my god, that's naughty, bro. The softness of the 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 donuts, the sweetness, and then you got this nice buttermilk chicken in between. You can't chat to me no more. I really can't. You can't chat to me. I, I just want to eat this. <laughs> can't chat to me. Mm. 
so good. It's so good. <laughs> <laughs> On to our next spot, guys. <laughs> All right, guys, so on days where, you know, it is a bit gloomy and doomy, you don't want to spend too much time outside. So we've got a motive plan for the inside. It is VR simulators. Bit on the nose, but obviously it's got VR plan. We haven't actually gone in. We're just going to give it a go. It's about 15 minute walk away from Glasgow Central Station. Let's go find out more. We've landed back in London now and my voice is back to normal. So hopefully all of you guys have enjoyed Scotland as much as we did, loved it. And let us know where else you want us to go in the comment section and we will make it happen. Three man abroad out and peace. Oh, okay, we're, we're, we're still here. <laughs> <clears throat> right, Scottish Moor is back. And as you can see, the behemoth known as Shaquille is is scraping the ice on his car. Proper manly man, you know. Ladies, in the comments, write down that Shaquille is a manly man. Okay, okay, out.